welcome back to Skyrim. My name is Guile. And hello, Mr. Jizago. He's looking very pretty in his fine armor. I'm here outside of Whiterun. And uh, last episode, uh, we got Sadia. And we basically um, took her in. And we, we, we basically, like, betrayed her. We didn't betray her. She asked us to do something. And then we went, nope, I'm not doing that. And uh, here she is on the floor still. Uh, pretty stinky, and it's really so heavy outside my window. You can probably hear that's crazy. Uh, anyway, hello. Um, what we're gonna be doing this episode is we are gonna go inside White Run, and uh, a lot of people did say to us, uh, "Squid, do the companions quest." Um, so I'm probably gonna start that this episode. Uh, I'm gonna go talk with the companions leader. I think it was the guy in the Sky Forge. So that's basically what I'm gonna do. Uh, but first, some things attracted my attention, and that thing is uh, a mammoth camp. And uh, it's always good uh, to start an episode by seeing Jizago getting flinged about 500 foot in the air. Uh, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to go see some, some big giant mammoths. We're going to go and... Uh... Oh, hello, Mr. Deer. How we doing? Pickaboo. Ah! This one's, like, really tame. Hello? They normally, like, run away from me, but this one just seems to be... Like, look, I wonder how far his neck can turn. Oh, there, there he goes. Now right, we're gonna get him. Should we, should we get him or should we leave him? Whoopew! Oops. <laughs> that was a right shot! <laughs> I got him like in the leg. Oh my god, that's crazy. Sorry, mate. Sorry. Uh, come on, Jizago. You're gonna go um, and be an astronaut again. Um, I'm only gonna do it like. I only wanna do it. I only wanna kill the mammoths. And um, I just wanna have fun with one giant before we start the companion's quest. I can't help myself. It's such a laugh. Uh, so we're gonna take care of this guy first. Uh, and I just absolutely love these eye spikes. They're just so good. Like, you can just fire them and just keep missing like I'm doing. Uh, but every time you fire one, the next one's ready. So it's just like a continuous spell. And they just beast mode. Like, it's crazy. Here we go. This guy's dead. Uh, jizago has got one of his staffs that I've given him. Uh, we need to take care of a mammoth, but I want to make sure I have a giant left uh, for a good bit of fun. Uh, where's there a giant? Right, one of them's over there. We'll take care of this guy first. Oh, I just missed. Uh, I think you have to... St I'm just... Did I hit a tree then? I hit a tree. Right, I'm going to get into position. Oh my god, that's a deep lake. And we're going to ice this sucker. Here we go. Boom. Boom. Jago, attack. Boom. 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 In the butt, butt shot. Oh, we would have a magicka. Never mind. We'll just go one and two. Do it like this. And he's dead. Take care of this sucker. Uh, Mr. Giant is about to come and um, give Jizago a good scene to. Um, so let's just see what this guy does. I can't wait. Jizago, where's Jizago gone? Where's Jizago? Jizago! I've got to make sure I don't kill him as well because last time I did. And uh, yeah, like I didn't realise but I, I did actually kill him. I first rust died him. Um, so yeah, oh my god. Ah! How many... How many babies <laughs> Oh my god. Run away. I don't think Fuss Rust Dad does anything to mammoths. Oh god. Oh god. Run away, Squid. Squid, run away, Squid, run away. I don't know what shot I've got on either. Oh god, there's a giant to me. Oh, where's Jizago when I need him? Oh god, this is never a good sign. Uh, i got to make sure I don't kill Jizago with this Fuss Rust Dad as well. That'd be annoying to start the episode. Um, okay, let's just run away. Run away, Squid. Run away, run away, run away, run away. And um, we're going to get him. Let's just do this. Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on, then. I can take you both. Fuss that did nothing! That did nothing at all! Quick! Is that a mud crab after me as well? There's a mud crab and a giant having a fight. That never goes well. Look at this guy. I thought you were going to die. Oh, God! Oh! Ah! Uh, Jizago! Help me! Please! I'm being attacked! I need your help! Where's Jizago? I don't see he's dead. If he's dead, I'm going to be very angry with you, Jizago. Even though that I can't really be angry because you're dead, but... Anyway, he should be around here somewhere. Um, anywhere at all? Jizago, he is the first giant we killed. The second one's coming. Oh, there he is. Just look for a, a, um, a lightning bolt coming. And uh, you know where Jizago is from, that. Come on, I want to see you get flooded up into the air. Is this, this, is this where it's going to happen? Or is Jizago just going to beast this guy to bits? I don't want to get in, kind of like. I don't want to get involved. I just want to sit back. And uh, I think he's going to actually kill this guy before he gets a hit on him. Jizago, stop being a beast. Jizago, you're spoiling all the fun. God damn it. Oh, well. At least we killed them. At least we unlocked a new thing. And we're a hell of a lot richer. Is there anything else we can do? 
Mm, I don't know if there's any goodies or anything on these camps. I'm not sure if they contain any decent loot. <clears throat> is, I think there's just one mammoth left. Uh, which we'll take care of because might as well clean the camp out. Oh, we missed. These are so powerful, but they're just like so hard to control because they're so small. Uh, there we go. Let's um, knife this guy in the face. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go. Here we go. Go on, Jazaga. We can take him. We can take this mammoth. I remember when I first started Skyrim and I just had no chance against these people. Oh, even though they're not people, they're actually mammoths. But uh, yeah, you get my drift. But now I'm beast mode and I can, I can take anything on. Um, they're basically, I don't think they've got any loot. They've just got a couple of skeevers on some barbecue skewers. They're having a nice barbie. Oh, look, a chest. Maybe not. I'll take it back. An expert. Say what? It's not going to go well. I can, I can feel it. <laughs> I've got 27, 26 lockpicks left. Watch me go through every single one of them. We'll try it this side. Oh, there's a bit of leeway here. So we know where our, our point is. Our biting point. <clears throat> uh, far to the left. This is going to take forever though, I reckon this is going to take a really long time, um, and let's just see, I'm sorry if it does take a while, but yeah, there we go, that's what happens when you're trying to lockpick an expert chest, it better have some good loot in it. Going pretty good though, so far, so just swing it, just swing it. <gasps> As if that nearly worked, let me just see if it is the proper, right, so we're just going to go up a little, no, so down there and then up a fraction, and then we go bang! A little bit more, bang! It must be there. It is there. Look. Let me go a bit up oh, higher. Yeah! Boom! A Dwarven Shield of Eminent Blocking. We've had that like a million times before. That was not worth three picklocks of my precious picklocking skills. But oh well, at least we get our picklocking skill up. Um, and we've iced all these suckers in the area. We've conquered another Mammoth Camp. Jolly good. So what are we going to do now? I'm going to hit Jazago in the face. Oh, I need to listen. Uh, so we're going to go and speak to this guy that does all the companion stuff. Um, and hopefully we're going to start our companion's quest. That is if... Um, oh, there we go. I thought it had frozen then. Right, so we need to go inside. Wide run again. What's this down here? Is that a bear? What do you think you're doing, Mr. Bear? Just, let's just ice this stuff in the game. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. Oh, God, I missed it. Jago, help. Jago. Help me. Never mind, we got it. Yeah, jolly really good. Right, anyway. We're going to fast travel... Uh, inside. We're actually going to put the quest marker on first, so uh, speak with the leader of the companions. I believe that's how you start the companions quest. Uh, I can't really think of any other way you could, uh, but he's actually in White Run himself. So we're going to hop in here, fast travel, and hopefully it might be morning soon. And we're going to speak to him on top of his Skyforge. And uh, I don't really know, I've never done, well, I obviously haven't done the, the uh, companions quest before, uh, but I don't know what it's going to do like if that makes sense like I don't know what happens in the quest uh, like I have played Skyrim before this let's play uh, but I don't think I ever did the companions quest and I don't know whether you get a companion because I've already got like Desargo so I don't really know how that works and my phone is vibrating like crazy I'm just gonna throw it on the floor I'm sure I'll just do something let's put it on my mouse mat hopefully it cushions the vibrations watch it fall off I'm gonna put it on here there we go jolly good right it's still night time it's um Nearly 5 to 4 in the morning. We're going to wait till about 5 to 9. Hopefully all these lazy people will be out of bed and uh, currently strolling around the marketplace. Here we go. Boom. Ah, lovely, lovely daytime. Uh, so we're going to see this fellow with his Skyforge and uh, see what it takes to join the companions. I think his Skyforge is up there, I believe. I kind of found it by luck last time, like how to get to it. I watch Blaze be around here now. He's going to ask for me for like another 1,000 gold, isn't he? Uh, so we go up here, we go past this place. Is it in? No, it's past this place. It's up, up here, isn't it? Um, oh, wait, is he around the back? Is he? Or is he in the place itself? Who are these guys? Oh, he's having a sit down. She's having a... Yeah, you know, that's a him. Never mind. Uh, I guess, is it in here? I guess it's I guess it's in here. <clears throat> Normally puts a quest marker on the door itself, but it's actually like telling us it's inside, somewhere inside this place. We'll just hop in. We'll go to Jorvaskara. Jovaskra. We'll, we'll go to the pub. I guess this is a pub um, <clears throat> or a place for the companions. It's one or the other. I'm going to guess it's a place for the comp companions, but we'll see. Uh, so we're going to speak to a fellow in here. Jazago's gone through the other entrance because he's just a, such a pimp. Um, 
Hello? God, this is a bit of a dangerous fireplace. You would have thought they'd have like a railing around it. What about if someone fell in there? That'd be well dangerous. People eating bread. Um, another person eating bread. Everyone likes bread around here. Apparently, it's the, um, the the best sort of food to eat is bread. Lovely baguette. Lovely. Lovely piece of baguette. Uh, and I think this guy's in the cellar. I don't know what he's doing down here, but I'm sure we'll find out. I'm sure there's a good reason why he's uh, down the cellar. Maybe he's sleeping still. I can remember last time he was in, uh, he was in the Skyforge. But is that the different... Ah, that might be a different guy. This is the leader, isn't it? Hmm. We'll have to see. Right, here we go. Hello! Najim Stonam. I want her. She looks cool. Jizago, why don't you look like her? She's a lot prettier than you. Uh, sorry, Jago. Um, <laughs> where's this guy? Hello! Housekeeping! Um, I'm here to, like... I don't know what I'm here to do. I'm here to look around and try and find the leader. Hello? Is there no... Oh, he's, he's through here! He's through here! He's having a good sit down. I still hear the Eating bread. Blood. Eating an apple all, pie. Mr. Codlack White Man. We can't... A stranger <clears throat> comes to our hall. I'm a stranger. And my name is Squid. And I would like to join the companions. Would you now? Here. Let me have a look at you. Hmm. Yes, this guy's eyeing me up. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. Yeah, accept me. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasker for yeah, those Yeah, you have empty beds for Squiddy, don't you? Eh, Vilkas? Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Look, I'm the best warrior Sometimes this land. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. I'm Dragonborn. What matters? I have a cool pussycat with me. Look at this guy. The man. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? You dare to question my skill? Um, I can handle myself very well. That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test you. Aha, Vilkas! Vilkas, take him out to the yard. You will die, Vilkas, but I will shove die. some ice cubes through your throat. Speak with the leader of the companions completed. Right, where are we going now? To the yard, take up arms. Come on then, Vicus. Come on, oh, he's, he's keen, he's running. Where's he going? What's these two doing? Are we going? Train with Vicus. come on. Up a skip and a jump. There we go, he's running. He's running, go on, son, you can do it. Oh my god, we're going to absolutely annihilate this guy. He's got no idea of who I am. Me and Jazago just laughing under our arm. We're like, ha ha, silly Vickers. Oh my god. Right, let's go through here. Apparently we need to go to the training grounds, follow this this guy, see where he's going to lead us. Um, but yeah, I don't know whether we're going to have a fish fight again, whether I'm allowed to use magic, whether I'm allowed to use a sword, or he's giving me some weapons. I don't know what's going to go on. I don't know what the arrangement is. Look at all this stuff. Battle axes. Right, where's Vickers going? He's going outside. Training grounds are out here, I guess. Go on, Vickers. Up you pop. There you go, Vickers, right. Oh, we can do this, guys. We can do this. We can slice this guy in the throat. It's going to be easy. I'm very I'm very confident about this guy. He doesn't look he doesn't look to be that scary. We can take him. He's not going to be a match for me and Jazago. Jazago's probably going to have to sit down and uh, let me and him fight. He can't get involved. Uh, but that's all right, because we don't need Jazago. He's only good for mage and stuff. He's only good with his, his, his staffs and his potions and stuff. He's not good with the old, good old sword. So let's do this. Let's do this. Let's kill this guy. Well, we probably won't kill him. I think we're just going to test our technique and see how good we are. Right, here we are. A couple of people sat down. Vickers is having some... Bre no, he's not as far as... Every, every people... All the people look alike. Look how much... These are the same... You are the... They're exactly the same. This is weird. This is weird. Oh, what? Oh, my God. He's teleporting as well. The old man said to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Le Just have a few swings at me so I can see your fall. <laughs> Don't worry. I can take it. Okay. <laughs> what? Ah, found you. Um, well, we are going to we going to we going to have a weapon. We're not going to, you know, come at him with um with the good old magic. Let's just take this out. Come on. Then. Come on, then, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Watch it. Watch it. Boom. What do you think this is? We don't do battle with magic around here, new blood. Now come at me. Okay, so he doesn't do magic. 
Oh my god, everything I've got's enchanted. <laughs> um what have we got? Should we take should we take him with a pickaxe? Um I don't know what to I don't know what to do. Um Should we just do this one? Here you won't leave here alive. Go on then, I'll just chop you up. What do you What do you think this is? <clears throat> We don't do battle with magic. I haven't got anything that's not magic. What's not magic? Um, an orcish dagger. Should I just poke it with an orcish dagger? Um, I think every single thing I've got has got an enchantment on it. That is poor, isn't it, Squid? Okay, we have to poke him with this dagger. I'm here. Come life. on then. No. You won't leave here alive. Where's my? What? There you go. Papa! I'm actually hitting him with a dagger. Not that. Next time won't be so easy. <laughs> you might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Okay. Um, apparently... Fresh blood. Hope you know how to handle yourself. Yeah, I do, mate. Do you want to come on then? To what do I owe the honor? Uh, right. Okay. So I got a quest. I'm this guy's errand boy. That's not fair. Uh, I had a fight with him with a dagger. That was a bit embarrassing. So let's have a look what we have to do. Uh, check palms. Here we go. Give the cast sword to Erlund, a legendary warrior. Why have we still got this on? Let's take this off. Put this on. Uh, legendary warrior of White Run, the companions have agreed me to let them join them. I can handle some primly tasks for them first. We've got to do a lot of errands. This isn't cool. Uh, where's this guy's... Where's where's the... Where's the quest marker pointing us? Where do we have to go for this thing? I don't know. Do we have to go in town? The quest markers give... Vicar sword to... Errand. Um, where is this guy? I'm very confused, guys. Um, I'm, this probably shouldn't be this hard, but... Um... Okay. Where is it? This saying in the, oh, is it up the top of there? I think he's up the top of there. Do we have to climb up this little thing? Oh, maybe. Maybe we'll just take the stairs. Maybe we'd have to do any rock climbing. That'd be a good, good idea. Oh, here we go. It's a guy with the sky forge again. What brings you here? I brought a sword from that guy. I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Yep. Um. Does Vikas always send newcomers on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. Okay. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the companions. Ooh. Someone has to be in charge, though. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman, her own. Okay, cool. I like this group. Um... Hmm, are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. Jolly good. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Call you Greymane. Best steel in all of Skyrim, all of Tamriel. Jolly good. Okay, I'll be going, mate. I have a favor to ask. Oh, not another guy with another favor. Come on, what is it? I've been working on a shield for Aeon. Oh, I've got to take the shield to her, My I guess. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could I'm take being the errand boy. Ah, <sighs> God. Didn't you just tell me not to be a servant? This isn't a command. Just decency. Help out an old blacksmith. I've got to get back to my work. Okay, for God's sake. Right, I've got a shield. I've got to go and take it to this woman. Um, oh, she's in there. That doesn't actually matter. We just do some uh, abseiling down the mountain. What's this guy doing down here? Hello? Farkas, right. Everyone looks alike. This is Farkas and his his freaky twin brother. That's crazy. Right, we're gonna go back in here and give this woman a shield back. And then we need to talk to Thingy again. Wait a minute, we need to talk to Farkas who was outside. Whoopsie daisies. Uh, we're gonna do this errand for uh, Greyman first and then uh, he'll be happy with me. Right, where's this woman? No shit, don't say she's in the cellar as well. Why is everybody in the cellar? Why do I have to go through two. Loading screens. Hello, Ninja. Can I get you as a companion? Make it quick. Okay, maybe not. Until <laughs> I'm gonna go in here, and uh, we'll give this shield back to her. 
Hopefully she'll give me something. Hopefully she'll be pleased with me about giving uh, the shield. Maybe. Hopefully. I don't know. I don't know. Hope she'll give me some gold. Hope she'll give me gold. And then I'll go back to Greymane. And he'll give me some gold. And then I'll go back to Far, whatever his name is. And then he'll give me some gold. That's the plan. Won't happen. Never happens like that. Um, What's the hurry? Oops, sorry, mate. Um, right, let's go through here. Love the red carpet. No, wrong. Wait a minute. Is it in here? Hello. Ooh, hello. I haven't seen your face before. I'm watching. Hey, look you. at your eyeball. <laughs> He's got a glass eye or something. Ooh, hello. If you wish to hunt with You've me, got something your on your uh, and face. Your eyes love. Quicker. Um, I have your shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Are you new here? I'm a new. I told you. This is the whelp that Vilkis mentioned. I'm not a whelp. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Yeah, with my dagger. Catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Of course I can. I would kill him before he drew his sword. Whoa, he's up there. We're rough, but there's no need to kill a shield brother over a dispute. I like your fire, though. You'll make a fierce companion. Let us hunt together sometime. Okay, let's do it. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Jolly good. I can't keep helping you with everything. You haven't helped me with anything. <laughs> Call me. Hello. Of course we did. Ice oh, Farkas. Hey, what? Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood. Oh, hello. Hello. I'm Farkas. Come, Where did I just follow me? I, did I just hit this? I'm confused. You again? Skior and Ale like did to I just me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Do you have a twin brother that's the leader, or was it you? Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I'm surprised looking at people that I just look like yourself. You. This can be a rough life. Okay. The quarters are up here. It's a nice Just house, a bed and fall in it It's a really time. nice house. I like this. Selma will keep the place clean. She always has. Okay. Where's my bed? All right. So here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Okay. Complete your tick of palms. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in White. I'm the Cold. muscle. I don't know what the fight is about. And that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. Okay. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Yes, ma'am. Yes, you're very far Can handle it. Man. Get you know to it then. Jolly good, Mr. Farkas. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, will you have one swing? Let's test that out sometime. Skior says that I have the strength of Isgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. Ah, your brother, your twin brother. Hello, guys, I'm the new guy. Might head down to the meadery later, see what they're brewing up. You can smell the honey on the wind. Jolly good. Okay, what's yeah, this guy? A this. I never thought they would actually let me join the companions. I like training one of the weapons. Now, Maybe I can like train with him. Uh, but for the time being, I've got some something. stuff to do. Uh, there's a lot of people talking down there. It's fairly confusing. I'm gonna go and just select a quest. I'm the hired muscle around here. Um, I've gotta go intimidate Elverinde in White Run. Uh, so let's do this. Let's let's intimidate this milk drinker. Ah, oh, God, it's gonna be amazing. We're gonna. It's gonna be like sipping his milk, and I'm gonna be like, don't do that. And I have to be intimidating and stuff. Hmm. Or I could kill a cow in front of him. Maybe that'd stop his milk drinking fun. I don't really know. I'm a, I'm a, sp I'm a speaking gibberish, guys. I think I am. Uh, anyway, why run? Here we go. We're gonna kill this. Mi no, we don't. We don't. We don't kill the milk drinker. Just intimidate squid. Intimidate. How do I? How do I be intimidating? Like, I'm a lizard and I've got a pussy cat like behind me with a gold thing on. It's just. It's not intimidating, is it? I mean, if someone did that to me, I'd just laugh. If it was just a pussy cat in armor. Yeah, it's not intimidating. I don't know what we have to do. Maybe I can like. Mutate into a really scary lizard. Or maybe I'll take all my armor off and just like bulk up and be like, oh, Stop, milk drinker! Don't do it! Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking rubbish and we're gonna go and uh, see this milk drinker guy. Where is he now? Do some free running. Hop! On the guy's head. Boom! Right, here we go. I know you too, mate. Wait, where's Jazago? Jazago! Here, boy! No, never mind. It's a good job because he'd just laugh at us if uh, I came with the pussy cat. So, 
Let's get over here. Where's this? Where's this goddamn milk drinker? Hey, what? Who does he think he is drinking his milk in in White Run? Uh, is he in his house? Oh, we, oh, we gotta go bust him. We gotta go bust him in the drunken huntsman. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be very funny. This I can't wait. It's gonna be a good laugh. Good to see his face. Maybe if he just like starts to drink the milk, I could just like smack it out of his face. Ah, you're the milk drinker around here. Ah, hello, my Argonian. Bro, <laughs> in the market for some hunting supplies. I've been sent to resolve a dispute. I'm gonna bro you. <laughs> you can't scare me into. Oh, submission. fist fight! Let's go. Oh, you want a fist fight? Come on, then. Come on. Yeah, man. Let's oh, see. Oh, fist fight you over the counter. Oh, I've just knocked you both. I'm gonna rough you. Place up as well. Come on then. Come on then. What you got? What you got, mate? What you got? Come on. In the face. Oh, you dodged. You dare challenge Boom. me. Boom. You're gonna punch me back. Come on. I, I didn't feel it. I'll give you a left hook and then a right hook. And then a left hook. And then a right hook. And then a 360 punch. 360 punch. And we're just gonna go for the headbutt. Ah! Uh, uh. <laughs> ah! There we go, you you goddamn milk drinker. Take that. You're tougher than you look. You got me fair and square. Yeah. You know what you have to do, milk drinker. Fine. I'll take care of it. Just please leave me alone. And if I see you drinking any milk around my face, I'm going to punch it out of your face. Anyway, Jizago, looks like we succeeded in this uh, milk drinking quest. Let's, uh, let's go back. But for now... Unfortunately, guys, it is the end of the episode here. Uh, we have jo joined the companions, I believe. Um, yeah, it's, look, it's pretty good. I'm just going to... I just I just punched the hell out of that guy, and now I'm just sitting down in his stool. I bet he's so angry with me. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to carry on with the companion quest next episode. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! The seaweed is always greener In somebody else's way You dream about gold up there But that is a mistake just look at the world around you, right here on the ocean floor. Such wonderful things around you. What more is you looking for? Under the sea, under the sea. Darling, it's better down where it's better. Take it from me. I'm not sure they were all.